Okay guys, this week, La Bamba, Richie Valens, really easy chords, but the words are a bit tricky because they're Spanish. So I was playing a C all the way across on the 5th, I was playing an F all the way across on the 10th, and I was playing a G all the middle and the high string on the 12th, and bass string open. If you haven't got arthritis like me, you might find it easier to play the C on the fifth and then put your index finger, middle string uh, on the third fret and the two outside strings with the other fingers and play the F there. So it's C, F and open G if you so wish. And it's probably easier that way. get there I have to turn my hand right away round because I've got no I've got restricted movement in these fingers so I can't just place it I have to go right way around with my wrist and I can't quite get it but that's that's my problem that's not yours so it's C G no it's not it is C F and G I played. I don't think that's for me that was easier. Anyway, so and that is all the way through the whole song. Every every verse, every chorus, whole song. <clears throat> so the intro, there is a, a, a proper intro to this, but I couldn't work it out, so I'm just gonna play the C F G twice. <laughs> Un poco de gracia, which basically means uh, to dance the bamba. Uh, to dance the bamba, it's necessary. It's necessary for us to be un poco, a little graceful. Uh, un poco gracia para mí, o para pa mí, para ti, arriba, arriba. Un poco gracia, so it's, we have to be graceful, me and you. Arriba, arriba. I don't know what context is being used in arriba because it normally means higher. Portisere, portisere, portisere. Yo no soy marinero, so I'm not a, I'm not a seaman, I am the captain. Yo no soy marin, marin, marinero. Soy capitán, soy capitán, soy capitán. And chorus, bam, ba, bam, ba, do, 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 bam, ba, bam, ba. That's the whole thing. The hardest part are the words, and they're all written down, and I've explained the pronunciations of different parts that could trip you up. So, hope you enjoyed that one. See you next week. No. <laughs> Parabala la bamba, parabala la bamba necesita un poco gracia, un poco gracia por mi arriba, arriba.
okay so you get the gist of it it's just doing those same bits all the way through you just got to learn the Spanish uh, so there's a verse there's a chorus it repeats three lines of the first verse next then there's a solo and the easiest way to do a solo on here would be and start whistling that sort of thing just getting a arriba and a in there and you'll sound Spanish all the way through or Mexican all the way through Yay! Same as the first verse again, but it's got four lines this time from the first verse. Then there's a chorus, and then there's a chorus again, and then there's the ending, and it ends with a cha cha cha. Probably doesn't make a lot of sense when I'm talking about it because I say it's all in Spanish, but I've written everything down. Shadow there. I've written everything down. And in the columns here, I've written down how to pronounce these different words. And there's, there's six lines there, and they're just repeated in part down here and down here. And that's all there is to it. Quite an easy, well, very easy to play. Take a bit of time with the Spanish. Get that right. You'll sound like a native. Anyway, very, very quick one this week. A lot of fun. Once you get into it, and uh, do a bit of whistling in there or whatever you're doing and you'll really enjoy it anyway so if you've enjoyed this particular one we'll see you next week see you in the next one bye for now Ooh.